One of my most asked questions is what equipment I use to film and edit my videos, and today I'm going to share with you exactly that. So this is what I call my kit, and it is comprised of my camera body, my laptop, my microphone, my zoom lens, my depth of field lens, my filming lens, camera cards, hard drive, and my card reader. I'm also currently filming this clip with some equipment that I'm going to share as well, so let's dive into each individual piece. The camera body I use to film all of my videos is the 5D Mark IV, and prior to this I did own the 5D Mark III, but a few features about the 5D Mark IV that really just made me purchase it was the fact that it had autofocusing capabilities and also that it was able to record 60 frames along with 30 frames at a high resolution. My Mark III wasn't able to do so, not to mention the photo quality is amazing. I have three lenses that I use to film my videos, but the main lens that I use to film almost every single video is the Sigma 35mm 1.4. The 1.4 of this lens actually refers to the aperture, which means that it gives off a very blurry background when you film at a 1.4 aperture. I do also use the 24 to 105mm lens because it has a zooming capability capability, which I love, and I mainly use this when I'm outdoor shooting or if I'm shooting for an event or something like that. And then last but not least, my 85mm lens. This mainly sticks on my camera for photos. I don't really do a lot of video with this, but it has such a nice depth of field for photos, and it's super inexpensive for a camera lens. I kind of wanted to show you guys the difference between the lens focal lengths on my camera. So here is what the 35mm lens looks like on my camera, and then we're going into the 85mm millimeter lens and last but not least this is the 24 to 105 at the full focal range the microphone I use is the Video Mic Pro by Rode, and it's pretty easy because you just clip it on the top and it records directly into the video file, so there's no need to like sync up audio afterwards, which is why I love this microphone. I also can't forget about my vlog camera. This is the Canon G7X Mark II, and I actually just recently got it, so I haven't done much with it yet, but I do plan on creating some vlogs in the future, and I, this is the vlog camera I will be using in case you are curious. I thought I'd just add it in. I love the flip-up screen. A quick little vlog sample so you can get the idea of what this vlog camera looks like. These next bits are super generic, so I'm just gonna link them for you below, but they are my hard drive, which is a 500 gigabyte hard drive that I edit off of, my camera card reader, which I picked up to read my CF cards, and then lastly, my CF cards and my SD cards, which I'll make sure to link my favorites below, but I don't really wanna go into it because it's kind of just boring. To film all my voiceovers, which is what I'm actually doing right now, I just use my iPhone and I use the Voice Memos app, and I find it to be really great, but just make sure to keep yourself about a foot or two away from your phone when recording the voiceover. And last but not least, we just have my laptop, which is a 15-inch MacBook Pro, and I use Final Cut Pro to edit all of my videos. I'm not going to go into how I edit in this video, but if you guys would like a video with my tips on how to edit your videos, give this one a thumbs up and leave a comment below, as I would love to know. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope this gave you some insight on what I use to film and edit my videos, and I'll catch you on my next one. Bye, guys.